in the second half, they did really well in that first 15, 20 minutes of keeping the ball and putting us under pressure and getting that first goal. Um, you know, and I thought we really responded and were able to put pressure on them and, and, and get that uh, goal that we, were, we hoped was the, the winning goal. Um, but, uh, you know, uh, we gave up a goal on a set piece. Uh, obviously, Alan Gordon's a very, very good player in the air, and, um, you know, it's something we need to do better on next time. Caleb mentioned taking time after a match like this uh, to let it sit in because you don't want that last second kind of reaction to, to be the one that, that overwhelms you. Uh, do you feel the same way? Do you, after a match like this, wait a few hours before kind of assessing the match as a whole? Always, yeah. I think you always have to wait um, before you can really uh, make a determination on, on, on how the match went. You have to watch the, the tape and... Uh, you know, really, really see you know what happened, what, what we did well, what we didn't do so well. Um, but you know, had had we been down a goal and, and scored in the last minute, you know, our feelings different. You know, it, it's just um, you know when when you get scored on in the last minute, um, it's always tough. And uh, but you know, I think from the last last two games, we've done a lot of very good things. Uh, you know, we, we've um, I think we've definitely established ourselves uh, ourselves as a very good defensive team. And um, you know, we we, we we scored some goals today, which uh, you know we hadn't done that last game. So. I think we can definitely bring those things into our game against Kansas City. I mean, now you go to Kansas City, first road match uh, of the regular season. What positives do you take from these first two matches that you're going to bring on the road to KC? Yeah, like I said, you know, I, I think uh, defensively as a group, you know, we, we were very good. You know, uh, Chara and Jackson and those holes, you know, Adi and, and Rodney and, and Darlington and Espria just did a great job for us defensively as well. Um, you know, not to mention the back line. Um, so, you know, I, I think that uh, the more games we play together, uh, the more success we're going to have, and I think the, the results are going to come. Nat, thanks. Let's back to you. How is that defensive chemistry coming along? Only two games in. I mean, it obviously yeah. takes a while. Where do you think that you guys are at in terms of being maybe the finished product? Uh, you know, we're, we're still, we're definitely still working on it, but, you know, I think that, you know, with uh, guys like Liam Rid Ridgewell back there, Jorge has been, you know, in this league so long, you know, he, he's, He's a, a veteran, and then Alvis is, you know, just a, an absolute animal there on the right side. You know, making my job easier. Um, so, you know, I think that uh, it's coming along, and you know, we're gonna learn from some some situations for sure, and make some adjust, adjustments. But you know, I thought uh, tonight we were pretty good overall.